Why are teenagers so attracted to drugs? Is it curiosity, rebellion, or is there something more? These are the questions that hover around the minds of many. The allure of the forbidden, the thrill of the unknown, or perhaps a deep-seated need to escape the mundane. What really draws our youth into this dangerous whirlpool? This isn't just a matter of idle curiosity but a pressing issue that calls for our attention. To answer these questions we've sought the insights of leading experts in teen psychology and drug use. Dive into the complex world of a teenager's mind with Dr. Jane Doe, a renowned expert in teen psychology. The intricate and fascinating landscape of the adolescent brain is a topic of great interest and concern, especially when it comes to understanding the lure of drugs. Dr. Doe explains, the teenage years are a time of exploration and pushing boundaries. This natural inclination can sometimes lead teenagers towards risky behaviors, such as drug use. The thrill of the unknown, the allure of stepping outside the norm, can be a powerful motivator. But it's not just about seeking new experiences, Dr. Doe adds. Peer pressure plays a significant role too. The desire to fit in, to be part of the group, can lead teenagers to make choices they might not otherwise consider. The fear of exclusion can drive even the most grounded individuals to succumb to the pressures of their peers. Moreover, the teenage years are often fraught with emotional turmoil. Many teenagers turn to drugs as a coping mechanism, reveals Dr. Doe. They might be dealing with stress at school, issues at home, or personal trauma. Drugs can provide a temporary escape from these realities. However, Dr. Doe emphasizes that understanding these factors is not about justifying or condoning drug use. Instead, it's about comprehending the roots of the issue to better address it. As we can see, the teenage mind is a complex one and understanding it is key to addressing the issue of drug use. Scene Script Dr. John Smith, a leading authority on drug use, helps us understand the allure of drugs for teenagers. Picture this, a world where you're invincible, where your problems are temporarily erased, where you're the life of the party. This is the illusion that drugs often create, a mirage that can be incredibly appealing, especially to teenagers. Dr. Smith explains that drugs can induce a sense of euphoria, a feeling of intense happiness and self-confidence. In the tumultuous teenage years where feelings of insecurity and self-doubt are commonplace, this temporary boost can be a powerful draw. Beyond the euphoria, drugs also provide an escape, an escape from the pressures of school, from the anxiety of fitting in, from the complexities of family life. For a moment they can make these issues seem distant and irrelevant. It's not hard to see why this could be enticing to someone in the throes of adolescence. And then, there's the cool factor. In a world where teenagers are constantly trying to define their identity, to stand out, yet also fit in, the rebellious image often associated with drug use can be tempting. It's a misguided notion of coolness but a potent one nonetheless. Yet, it's crucial to remember that these are just illusions, fleeting and ultimately destructive. The reality is far harsher, with long-term effects that can derail a life before it's even begun. Drugs might seem attractive, but the dangers they pose are far from it. Now that we understand the why, we must focus on the what now. The power to change the narrative lies within each one of us. Education is our greatest weapon in preventing teenage drug use. It's not just about teaching teens the negative effects of drugs but also about fostering open and honest conversations. We must strive to create a safe environment where they feel comfortable sharing their thoughts and fears. Let's explore some resources that can aid us in this mission. Websites like the National Institute on Drug Abuse and the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration provide a wealth of information on the dangers of drugs and how to address this issue effectively. They offer strategies for parents, teachers, and community leaders to engage with adolescents on this sensitive topic. But what if you're already dealing with this challenge? Where can you turn for help? Organizations such as the Partnership to End Addiction provide support to families struggling with substance abuse. They offer guidance on how to navigate through this difficult time and where to find professional help. The key here is communication. It's about listening, understanding, and offering guidance without judgment. It's about showing our teenagers that we care about their well-being and that we're here to support them. Remember, knowledge is power. Equip yourself and others with it to combat the allure of drugs. Together we can make a difference.